Let me show you in this video the tricky way of texturing our vitrines in the shopping areas. So what we've done in the previous video, we made a copy of the glazing and we brought a bit backward just for using with a very light material and that's the texture we're gonna use applying on it with the help of the V-Ray lines material and what you see on our screen you can increase a bit light and by using the texture you also start actually you let actually the glazing to glow and because I need to, pre to have nice preview of the UV mapping what I would like to bring over I'm gonna use a simple very material first until I, I got my texture in the right position and you see I'm using the very material until I get the right scale of the texture on the surfaces and after I will bring the light material over and the trick here is just that the light material will start to glow and to drop nice reflection just behind the glass and actually this double facade will play the nice illusion of that something details are standing behind in the three-dimensional way and actually what we've done is just to adjust the texture and the purpose of the light material is uh, to bring much more contrast in the details of in this in the texture itself because because the, be, without the Red material it will be pretty blurry and will not work properly as the vitrine and that's the K and actually the trick behind texturing facades in general of buildings and exterior projects so use it try out Fix with the UFV map the texture on your surfaces, use the light, be very light material, and you stay happy with the result. You see, we, we have almost done what we are striving to have. There is also another technique of using plugins, which we will cover in another video, but for now, we've done successful and we create nice texture on our shopping glass vitrines thanks for watching